Oh boy. Got to throw one more chase level in, don't you? Oof. The worst part about all this is I'm having to do all of this without an extra heart. Even if I did have an extra heart, though, I definitely would have lost it in the bosses by now. Oh, okay, jump over that. Uh, that's probably bad. That's probably bad. Okay. I don't know how long this is gonna be. I usually end the videos at like 45 minutes. But I haven't, like I'm still in this level. Oh, is there a chance to run under that or do I have to jump over it? Because that time it looked like I was very close to running under it. That's good timing. Okay. I jump off the rope early. Oh, there's ropes twirling on that thing. If I jump off the rope early enough, I can just run under that saw blade. Now. Oh, nope. Too early. Okay, I should be able to run under it. Yep, just barely. Okay, so wall jump. Oh my god, I skipped the wall jump. Ay, yeah, yeah. You're gonna make me hit stuff as I go here. Wait, wait, I didn't get high enough there. What? I don't understand what happened there, but okay. That is so tight there. Damn it. So I can skip the wall jump there completely. Which I'm assuming gets faster. I don't think I jumped early enough. I made it though. <sighs> I feel like I didn't get a high enough jump there. Also, for some reason I thought it was a wall run and I just stayed there expecting to go up. Too early. Good to know there's a window where you can avoid the saw blade but still not jump high enough. Don't jump off the top of that, just naturally run off the top. Why, why did you stop, Rayman? Right, why? Why would you stop? Why, why would you do that to me? Okay, definitely not making that. Definitely fell behind. Is this getting tiring yet, seeing me do the exact same section over and over again? I didn't jump nearly high enough that time. Yep. 
Why am I not jumping high enough to grab the rope anymore? Why does he stop? Why are the controls so stupid in this? Go. Got it this time. Oh my god. Slowly falling behind. Yep. Fell behind too much. I'm not even getting practice on that last part that I somehow didn't get high enough on. Because I keep fucking dying back here, bro. That's bad. Fell behind. It might be all... No, no, it's bad. It's... How, how am I still here? I think I get that part. I was confused because I fully expected I was dead, but I lived somehow. But I think at that part that I just died at, you don't wall run. You jump and wall jump. I miss the ropes completely. How does that even happen? Like, I don't understand how a game can be on a perfect cycle every time, like it's just meant to be, and somehow just mess up slightly like that. I'm slightly behind because that definitely skimmed my head. I think we're doing good here, though. Okay. I, I was too fast? Maybe I do wall run there, and I'm just dumb. Because doing the wall jump got me too far ahead. Getting to the point where I'm just going to go completely silent and probably edit out every attempt that I fail at and just cut back when I do have this. I don't make any forward progress in the next five runs, we'll say. Next four runs? Then that's what I'm going to do. jump there, I think. Oh. Oh. I don't know how I... Oh my god, I gotta grab that at the end. How long is this section? How long? I did see how to make it through that one part, though. Oh my god. Yeah, on that one part, you don't do continuous wall jumps because you'll fall behind and you won't be able to get the fruit thing. So you gotta jump between the walls which I'm not sure if I can pinpoint which walls I jumped in between and do that again 
so that's going to be fun to do. Good. Good. Okay. How? I, you didn't glide early enough. I held down the glide button, bro. I'm glad he's just having a, a fun little time flying through all this garbage. Like, literally just flies straight through all the walls and everything. Doesn't have to avoid the buzz saws. Love that, love that, love that, love that, love that. gotta grab that first rope you gotta grab that first rope or you're you, it'll just slam you out of the screen and instantly kill you Like we're. Why did you stop, Rayman? You stopped! That was so good, but he just stopped and he. Ah. can't hear it through my mic, but I have the heaviest fucking breathing going on right now. Ah. Uh. This is it. This is my hell. This is my pain and suffering. This is for everything that I have done wrong in life. This is for everything that I will ever do wrong in life. This is for everyone that has ever done anything wrong in life. I am taking everybody's suffering right now. I think I'm jumping way too early onto that wall so that when I jump off the wall, I'm not jumping high enough. Nope. Nope. No, there's no way. There's no way. I'm still... Okay, never mind. I'm good. I'm good. Turns out that one ledge grab isn't enough to completely destroy your hopes and dreams after all. But it's pretty damn close to enough. Fuck you. Actually, go fuck yourself, dude. Cut my toe. I need to glide a little bit longer onto that platform. That way that doesn't happen. And as long as Rayman just doesn't stop when wall running there, then it should be okay. Okay, we're good. 
That was very close to not being good, but we are good. We did it. We did it. We... There's a flying section. Oh my god, when does it end? When does it end? I'm probably like running through at least both the blank levels at once. I'm gonna end up splitting this into two parts. Oh my god, why aren't you ready for me? Don't you understand? How grave the situation is. I I already lost my heart. We're collecting lums here. Wait. We're collecting lums here, which means this isn't the blank section. Which means this is the, the final level. At the final level, I'm pretty sure. Which I thought would be a boss level. But it's not. It's it's a flight level. So it's terrible. I need probably every extra heart I can get for lums. I say as I lose a heart. There was a heart down there. Good to know. I'm not paying attention to how these are exploding, and it's hurting me. They're sending so many of them out. Okay. That was pretty good. Wait, what? Oh... Okay. See, the thing is, now that I've gotten this many lungs, I can tell you it's definitely going to be 300 for the final elect tomb. Please, not the beginning. Not the beginning. Oh, okay, good. Not the beginning. Uh... Gotta think so fast. Probably be worth it to grab that earlier. That's fine. We're good. I completely botched that. Lovely. Come on. Come on. Oh, we got rockets. But this is also probably a checkpoint. Oh, this is the boss. I think. Maybe not. Finger slip there a little bit. Oh! Let's chill out. Let's just chill out a bit.
I can definitely get all the lums I need here for 300. Let's go straight ahead so they all collide for the most part. Why is this thing still following me, bro? Get away from me. I don't want you here. is of course everything but like also the fact that I really have to concentrate and get the lums I need at the same time and there I just missed some because I didn't kill that first wave of bugs And I'm short now, but I have a heart. Maybe I should just stop worrying about lungs. Because now it seems like it's given me plenty. And before, this is like the one level where I need over 300. Am I shooting... Not the blimp. I'm pretty sure I'm still shooting the bottom. I don't know what I'm shooting on here anymore. There are go-back arrows. I just bounce off when I shoot that. Okay. Did I... Did I do it? The music ended. Holy shit. And right back to sleeping and snoring, just like the beginning of the game. Holy shit, was that hard. One saving grace, though, is like once you play all the way through it, they're separate levels. So, like, I'm pretty sure the two bosses were one blank level, and then the chase was the next blank level, and then that flight section was its own level. So, like, at the very least, you can just start at the flight scene, just so you can get the lums, the electums. We have all the electums now, by the way. We're at the credits. I don't know what the point is. Of me just being able to jump around here. Oh my god. <sighs> I cannot explain how stressful that entire last few levels that were all connected was. And going to it straight out of a really hard time trial? That wasn't fun either. So, so let's recount. We walk up to the magician, and he drops us into the trap door where we fight two bosses. The bosses really weren't that hard, but realizing 
not remembering the pattern for the first boss and having to relearn it, and then not getting a checkpoint right before it, and having to redo that one part every time, that was a little... a little annoying. It wasn't really hard, but it was annoying. And then that whole running section, that chase section, that was hard as balls, dude! That was hard as balls! And then the flight section after that, like... I definitely felt the difficulty in it. But I think coming off of the chase section that was a hundred times harder definitely downplayed the flight section. Definitely. Overall, though, a very extremely difficult ending sequence. Oh, man. But we're here. We're at the credits. I'm going to shut up now and let the credits play. And as long as they're not too long, we might try the Land of the Livid Dead level after this. I can't see that being its own episode. It can't be that hard or that long after what we just did. So I'm hoping I can just tack it on to the end of this one. This is all going to be a two-parter, by the way. Like, I'm an hour and 16 minutes into recording right now. I'm not going to upload an entire hour and 16 minute video. But yeah, I'll shut up now and let these play.
I think that was a very nice break after that sequence, just sitting back and listening to the peaceful credits music. Th this game has some good music, but also we have everything in the game now except for the land of the livid dead stuff. And this recording has been going on for over an hour and 35 minutes now. We're going to go ahead and actually end it off here. I didn't mean to. I meant to go to the uh, snoring tree. We're going to end it off here. There will be one final episode where I go into the land of the livid dead. I don't know how long that's going to take. It might not be an entire episode's worth. It might be another two hours. <laughs> Who knows? All I know is that we'll be going into it with the final skin. This, like, undead Glubox looking thing. What does the Elder Teensy guy... I think he's an Elder Teensy. Who let Glumbrox out of his cage? I don't know what Glumbrox is, but we'll be doing it with Glumbrox. But thank you all for watching. I will see you next time for the finale of Rayman Origins. And, yeah. That's about it. Bye-bye!